on? Yeah, it's on. Okay. How are you looking? You need your glasses on? No, I'm so just feeling cool? to know this bitch. All right. I step away from it. You just get to know. Yeah, it. don't look me in the eye, bitch. Mm -hmm. Eye, bitch. No. Yeah, don't lie, bitch. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of blood in your penis. Too much. Well, I won't, I'm not even pumping it. No. Now I'm gonna hold my penis and bump it. Bump it. Bump it. Bump it. Bump it. <laughs> okay, you know I did. You know I did. But anyways, the reason we're filming is that the beer, as I was explaining before, the uh, the wines, all variations of the uh, imp implications of your reactions to your experiences and your interaction. Um... Come to a point in understanding, just here talking to my friend, a uh, my, couple of my friends, that beer is quite, quite a good metaphor, a good example of society. Beer, the consumption of beer is quite a good metaphor for the way that society works, the way that society works as a whole. And, Okay, so you drink your beer. Oh, well, I better, I better do it. So, you drink your beer, right? No, it's a fractal. It's a fractal geometry, really. No, I... It, it, you know, I almost hate this film. It's almost like filming a Salvia trip or a DMT trip. It's kind of invalid. It doesn't really document what I'm trying to say, but what I am trying to say should probably be documented. Express up. yourself. I must tell. I must, yeah. Ugh. But don't just express about how you need to express. Mm. Don't just express uh, the, the, the need to express. Chug. How is <laughs> the beer? Yeasty. Yuck. Yeah. <laughs> so the consumption of beer. Why do we do it? Why do we do it? Why is it so common? Why is it so legal? <coughs> so gross. It's so accepted. By the church, by the government, by the taxes, by every store that sells beer, by every high school, by ev everywhere, everywhere, everywhere. I had my first beer probably at four years old, three years old, four years old, I don't know. Somewhere around there I tasted a beer. Remember it. But you know what I remember most? Not the taste of the beer, because that was awful. But it was getting together with people. And it's almost like we've kind of sacrificed that getting together with people that we used to do around a fire that we don't need to do anymore with alcohol. And now with maybe television or internet. Oh, I haven't seen my buddy for four or five years, but you finally gave me a message on Facebook. Now I feel like I know him. Again, still, I know where he's at. Yeah, I know where she's at. I know, oh, how she's doing. Oh, I send you a love letter. I really love you. I really love you ever since high school. And you still don't, you don't even call me back. And God damn you for that. God damn you. Because you are a lover of mine. And I God damn know that you <laughs> love me too, and you won't admit it. You will not admit it <laughs> to yourself and to those around you because you're ashamed of who I am, but you don't even understand who that is. And then what I'm saying, okay, besides the point, it's not a love story. That's fine now. <laughs> Waste of beer. The consumption of beer is a metaphor for society. It's bubbling. It's yeasty. It fucking feels heavy. It'll replace a sandwich, but it will probably give you the shits if you do that. It's nasty, yet it's bliss when all you can get in your life is a little tiny bit of cash from some stupid job. At the end of that stupid job, all you want is a little bit of tobacco and some fucking beer. 
And if you don't drink beer, you're probably going to replace it with uh, copious amounts of coffee or some sort of pharmaceutical drug. I, I mean, the, the idea of getting yourself fucked up is, an, is, is, an, is a metaphor and an example for the way that society is going. And I don't mean this as a joke at this moment. I mean this fucking for real. Our whole society in the Western culture is just trying to get fucked up. It's not trying to have a good time, which good time actually makes a lot of people nervous. A real good time without drugs or alcohol it makes people nervous. And uh, so I'll drink the beer, get fat, continue to necessitate the beer and get fatter. Just go with it though, because when you're having a good time, this is the shit, and we love it. We love it very much. We love life. Society loves itself by just crippling itself, it's getting itself fucked up. One of these days, we might not need to drink. We could probably do some other things, right? Did you stop recording? Because I, okay, the, the the main point is that there's many other things that can get us fucked up together. We can all get fucked up together on other things. It's not just alcohol. Although I love alcohol, I love meeting people like you that want to get fucked up and avoid your life. But we, we can evolve our life too. We, we don't need to just avoid it. But I love meeting you while we are avoiding it. I love it. Very much so. I love marijuana. I'm very pro-cannabis, pro-LSD, pro-DMT, pro-alcohol, pro-mushrooms, <sighs> pro-tobacco, not government-supplied. Although I love alcohol, pro-alcohol, and I wish we could have our own. I wish we could have, grow our own alcohol. Cheers to you and all that you do. Maybe it was a message to the people too.